Hello and welcome to another telehealth information video. My name is Garvin and today's video is on pyridoxine tablets. <clears throat> so pyridoxine tablets contain the active ingredient pyridoxine hydrochloride or more commonly known as vitamin B6. So pyridoxine tablets are used to treat conditions such as vitamin B6 deficiency, idiopathic sideroblastic anemia and PMS. So pyridoxine is also used to prevent and treat nerve problems associated with isoniazid and penicillamine treatment. Vitamin B6 cannot be produced by the body and is therefore obtained solely from the diet. Pyridoxine works by replacing absent vitamin B6 in the body. Pyridoxine deficiency is rare because it is found in most foods. However, it can occur during treatment with isoniazid for tuberculosis or penicillamin for Wilson's disease. And this can result in inflammation of the nerves. It may occur as a result of poor diet and chronic alcoholism or malnutrition. The female hormone estrogen can also reduce levels of this vitamin in the body. Vitamin B6 deficiency can cause weakness, depressive symptoms, anemia, nerve problems, and skin disorders. <clears throat> the dose of pyridoxine will vary depending on the individual person's needs and condition being treated. Make sure to follow your doctor's instructions regarding the dose. Pyridoxine tablets should preferably be taken with a glass of water with or after food. While no harmful effects have been seen when pyridoxine was given at recommended doses to pregnant and breastfeeding mothers, it is still recommended to seek your doctor's advice before taking pyridoxine if you're pregnant or nursing. Taking pyridoxine at recommended doses won't produce any side effects. However, if you take pyridoxine in very high doses, it can cause side effects. If you notice any side effects while taking pyridoxine, stop taking it and talk to your doctor immediately. So some of the main side effects of pyridoxine include headache, loss of appetite, nausea and vomiting, and tingling. And remember, all medicines have potential side effects, but this doesn't mean that you'll experience them. That brings this video to an end. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments below or contact me through lynchespharmacy.com. Thanks for watching. Stay healthy and stay informed.